it's Monday morning and uh, getting going. Today is the eclipse day. So um, if you're around here, you know about it. Everyone's talking about it. Um, we were close to the band, very close to that band. Uh, we should be able to see it here at our store in Hubbard. Maybe not as good as other places, but we should be able to see it here. Um, but our store at the Eastwood Mall is very much in that band. So I think JJ's out there today. He should see it real good. So we'll see what happens with some pictures or some stuff like that. Uh, as far as what I'm doing, it's Monday morning. I finished my taxes and tax season is right around the, well, tax day is right around the corner. I'm going to finish up that Ludwig order, a couple other small orders, and uh, this is what we got going. We got TJ coming in later. Connor's off today because he's going to stare at the eclipse. Brian's off today because he's going to be on a kayak staring at the eclipse. So I don't know. They might come back Tuesday blind. Um, hopefully they, they got those glasses. So uh, yeah, check in. We'll let you know what's happening with the uh, eclipse. We'll see what happens when TJ gets here. Happy Monday. I just got to the store. I'm going to bring Robert a gift real quick. Hey, Hi. I brought you something. I'm really excited. You're you want to turn the music down? Yes. I brought you something too. That was... There we go. Do I need to sit down for this? You can if you want to. Alright, what, what, what do you got there? Hold on, let me put that down. Other than Eclipse glasses. <laughs> little Bengals dragons. That's not little at all. It's this one is. Huge and amazing. This one is. These are amazing, and my kids are gonna love them. You're a talented man, TJ. 3D printed Bengals dragons. It's a man of many talents right <laughs> here. Hey, while this is rolling, let's take a quick walk out here. Speaking of my kids, let's look at this real quick. My son once made his own business cards. So we actually got them business cards made. So uh, here's Robbie's. And here is Josephine's. Girl boss. Jo already packed some of, the, some of these up to take to school to pass on to her uh, classmates and the teacher. I, so, I, lo I love the girl boss. That's cool. I don't know if I, well, I packed some away. Oh, here's Robbie's. What got this whole thing started was Robbie made his own business cards at one point. So we decided to get them. They're real ones. Um, and then what I brought for TJ, he might have saw it already, but we'll, maybe we'll try these on camera. I actually... Probably didn't because I was too focused on all this stuff. We'll pass some of these up to customers, but my, lovely, my lovely wife brought us moon pies. You know who really likes moon pies? Who? My dad. Really? Yeah. We should get big tea down here. To be yeah, fair, I mean, I'm a sweets guy, so I've probably had one, but if I had, it's been a, it's been a long time that I can't even remember what they taste like. So we'll try moon pies. Solar Eclipse Survival Kit. Right, right. Clever marketing. Um, And we'll pass them out to the folks that come through the store today. Yeah. So. That's awesome. Moon pies. Uh, Me and TJ will try them in a minute. You ready for the Eclipse? We, hey, we should try them with these on. We'll put them on. <laughs> okay. Try moon pies. We'll, we'll eat them. We'll eat them as the Eclipse is happening. Happening. No, we'll just eat them in here first. All right, that works. All right, we'll catch up in a bit. More to come. Let's just pop them out. Let's just get the tops open. Which one do you want? I think I'm going to try that one. This one? Yeah. Well, what do you want? Switch. You want to try the chocolate? Yeah, I like the chocolate ones. Is there, what's it look like in there? Oh, okay. They're just little. Perfect. Little wrapped little. All right. Oh, is it running? Pieces of joy. All right, let's start with the... We're not going to be able to see any. I know. We're going to start with these on. We'll take them off. Oh, I was... Are we doing this for, like, socials? I didn't do it for the vlog. No, oh, because it's... I mean, it's been going. I know. <laughs> You want to you want to like just put them on and then we'll then that that'll be like. I don't think I can one. wear this with my with my glasses. Just put them on for a minute so the people can see us with them on. All right, you got them on. Yeah. Okay, now look at the camera for a second. We'll be quiet and I'll start the video. All right, so um, we're ready for the eclipse. Um, the only problem is these are so dark we can't see anything. So um, we're gonna try these moon pies we brought in today. Um, but we're blind, so I'm gonna take. We're gonna take these off. We thought it'd be funny to wear them and eat, but you can't see. You can't see through these things. TJ, I don't gonna, need to see to eat. He's gonna eat his blind. My um, eyes are wide open right now, and we'll see. I can't see. He's trying a chocolate moon pie. I'm gonna go with the vanilla, and apparently, no one likes banana. 
Um, my dad might like banana. I don't know. I actually don't know. <laughs> um, but we'll see. We'll see if his dad likes banana, and we'll see who the first person is at the store to take us up on a banana. I'm Ooh, ready to right. open. Go ahead. Let's go. Mm, yummy pieces of joy. All right. Cheers. Cheers. I wouldn't touch it to be see. It might be sick. Oh, All okay. right. Mm. It's been a long time since I've had one. I can get into this. There should be eclipses every day. Sure. All right. Since 1917. We're going to finish these. I'm going to get a drink. We're going to get back I, to work. I have a drink. We're going to get back to work. I can't see. I'll stop the vlog. You literally can't see anything. Hey, I just turned the vlog back on. TJ, can you kind of look at the camera? All right, that's good. Enough. He's got his glasses on. He said they're so dark, he can't even see through them. So they wanted to guess how many fingers I'm holding up. All right, TJ, guess. Three. Wrong. Four. Guess again. Five. Wrong. One. Close. Guess again. Two. Wrong. See? The lanes are dark. He's never going to get it. We'll see you in a minute. Am I supposed to say anything beforehand? Or am I wait, 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 wait. What, what flavor is that? Banana. He picked the banana one. Banana the, one the first one. No, the, that guy that left earlier picked the banana. What? Yeah. Banana's in the lead now. Banana's great. I mean, We always knew you like bananas. <laughs> you <laughs> just spit crumbs at me. <laughs> you the, weirdo. I found the thumbnail for the next vlog. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be using that. <laughs> yep. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Tell him, Anthony. TJ. Hey. Talk to us about the eclipse. So it's very cloudy out. Um, it's also very, it, it's it's weird looking out right now. It's like dark, but it's also midday, but it's super cloudy out. There's a, there's a drone up there. It kind of peeks through the clouds a little bit. You can kind of see it without even needing the glasses, except for this one spot here. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not looking way at that, but uh, I don't know, it's pretty cool out. So pretty slow day inside the shop because everyone's outside looking at the eclipse. Wow. This is kind of weird out, isn't it? Yeah. It feels like the apocalypse. It's like a tornado Yeah. So there's your eclipse update. I wish it was sunnier, but <laughs> you know, here we are. All right, it's the end of the day on Monday. Um, I've locked up, all the teachers are gone, students are gone. So, um, we walked to the back. So today was a, an interesting day. The eclipse was pretty cool. It was really, uh, it was nice and cool outside during it and uh, it looked really weird. Um, it was like 3.30 and it felt like 8.30. So, um, yeah, so end of the day. Um, that's really about it. There wasn't much happening today except for the eclipse and then Rob and I took care of some rental stuff. So um, yeah, that's about it. So Rob will see you guys tomorrow. I will see you guys on Wednesday. Hey, um, Tuesday morning. It's already things uh, things happening here at the mall. I Right now I'm doing payroll. So uh, one of the things I do here, so I gotta do payroll, the guys like getting paid. So it's that time of the month. Also though, I've already, we brought a couch out here. I had an old couch from my house. Um, so we brought a couch out here first thing. Um, in our lesson room next door, we don't go over there too often. Um, we have one couch. So I brought another one somewhere for like the parents to sit while their kids are taking lessons. So we got that in. Then I had a customer waiting for me. He picked up a couple guitars from layaway and uh yeah so i wanted to jump in real quick before the day gets going i got a sales rep coming in today um it's our audio technica sales guy a couple other things so he's gonna stop in around noon if he has something great i'll show you guys um uh, yeah that's it i'm gonna get back to doing payroll but i'm gonna show you real quick uh the lesson room and the couch not really, really that exciting but we don't make it over to that lesson room too often so take a quick look all right, so I flipped the camera over. Let's take a look. I creep some people out filming on the walk here. Yeah, so uh, this is our lesson room. So here's where we do our lessons in here. A couple spots back there. Here's the couch we had. There's the new couch. Uh, my wife is not gonna like the way Anthony put that cover on there. So we're gonna have to deal with that. Um, but yeah, there's a new couch. Here's the lesson room. So uh, it's kind of plain. We'll probably dress up some more at some point, but it gets a job done. People learn how to rock it. So back to the other spot. 
So cruising through the day here. Um, the meeting, not that exciting. Um, now I'm doing some inventory. We are doing some stick ordering to fill some gap. Gotta order some heads. Gotta order some more of these. Um, these have been cool so far. So uh, we're doing a bundle of five pairs of Promuco sticks. So five pairs of sticks, 20 bucks. Can't beat that. That's going good. Ordering some attack stuff. We need some heads and some other random drum stuff. Also, Anthony, what's happening? I'm what are you working on? I think this is my new signature. It's just every time you see me, I'm just like the, give you the like smile. Like the wave. princess wave? I like to think so. Yeah, it's like the nice, good old princess wave. So Anthony's dusting, cleaning up. Head princess, yeah. cleaning up. You know what I mean? Not that we're about gender roles here necessarily, <laughs> but. <laughs> Someone has to dust, and it's Anthony. <laughs> um, yeah, he's finishing up dusting. Got a couple orders, a Diodario order, doing some Evan stuff as well. Like I said, some attack stuff, some drumstick stuff, Vader, Promark. Um, ordering some Remo heads to fill some gaps. And then the Ludwig order is not quite done, but it's just about there. I plan on submitting that tomorrow, so you'll probably see that tomorrow morning. And, uh, yeah, we got JJ coming in soon. He'll take over. And... I'm checking the toilet next. See, oh, he's going to clean the bathroom next. Like, I mean, you guys don't want to see the footage, but it should be. No, you don't. It should be documented because it doesn't get cleaned as much as it should. Where are you going? <laughs> All right, we'll talk to you later. <laughs> so when we first started this vlog, we were making jokes about how most of our content has been filling the humidifiers. But I've decided that from now on, I'm gonna do Anthony Gill's humidifier hot takes. Um, because I like seeing arguments in comment sections and reading them for hours. So with that being said, my first hot take is this. The Beatles were not nearly as influential on American music as the Rolling Stones. I'm willing to argue that all day long. You know, oh, the Beatles are the greatest band of all time. The Beatles, blah, 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 blah. The Beatles were good. I like the Beatles. They were influential on a lot of things. I agree with that. But if you think they were more influential on American music than the Rolling Stones, then I gotta ask you something. Where's all the chords? Why is there not more than just hooks and riffs? That's what the Stones were about. That's what they did. They made that popular. So please tell me. So I said I was done filming for the day, but I'm not. I had like a half hour left before JJ came in and took over and uh, power went out. So uh, power's out in our store. Um, it's not out in the whole mall, as you can see, but literally not just our store, our, this entire wing. So like everything on our side of the mall is currently out. So yeah, dark, um, but I'm in the store, dark. Um, I'm doing nothing actually. Let me turn back so you can see me. I'm doing nothing actually, cause there's nothing to do. Um, but our teachers are still teaching. They're teaching in the dark. Yeah, their cell phone flashlights out and they're going for it so uh it's kind of cool so yeah um we'll see what happens i talked to maintenance i talked to mall management they don't know what's going on apparently the power department's on its way out and uh yeah it's acoustic for now acoustic only so power's out we'll see what happens probably won't see you any more today talk to you tomorrow so jj just got here we'll talk to him when he gets over here hey jj what happened i don't know i, I went outside and uh there was a red fire truck that's it. Where's Gil? They're teaching still. Animals. Yeah. So yeah. So yeah. Uh, if we walk outside right now, you can see something on fire. It's like something like on fire, but it's out in the water. Oh, I can smell it. Yeah, it smells off. They're having themselves a little shindy. So yeah, there we go. That's what's happening. Yeah. Firebirds don't have power either, guys. Bad day at the mall. JJ, we're hoping you could bring you could bring life back to all of this. I'm gonna bring the power back. I've got the power. Bring the power, buddy. I've got the power. So, update on the light situation. It's back on. Uh, I we literally just walked over to our other storage room. Um, I got old school paper, handwritten receipt paper. So, just by chance, if someone wanted to buy something while the power was out, we could write the receipt. And literally, no sooner did we grab them, then the power came on. So we don't need them. Power's back on, we're back to good, and uh, JJ's taking over. So good things, we're electrified again.
you guys what's happening wednesday morning it's been a weird week i don't know why but it's wednesday morning I asked my wife today i said what day is it not date what is the day it's one of those weeks so uh yeah yesterday we talked about at the mall i'm putting together an order for some accessory stuff some attack drum heads some drum sticks uh some pro mark stuff that kind of thing uh so now i have to see what we have here at the store in hubbard see if we need anything and uh so we order that stuff together the shipment will come in and then we'll split it as needed so yeah, that, that's, that's what I'm doing first thing, splitting those sticks or counting those sticks and uh, seeing what we need. We, uh, got the, we got the five pairs of sticks for 20 buck bundle here. Uh, they've been doing pretty good. So we got to refill those here as well. Um, and yeah, that's where we're at. I think someone's coming in the back. Oh, it's Tom. Uh, I'll be right back. All right, so a uh, brief interruption, old friend of the stores uh, snuck in the back door. So uh, yeah, back to work here. Um, looking at stick rack here, seeing what we need. A few holes here and there, but uh, yeah, we're gonna check on these uh, Vader sticks, some Promark stuff. Um, there's our bundle deal. So yeah, we're gonna check into that. Check our attack drum head selection, see if we need any more of those, anything we need from those guys. Maybe a few Wuhan symbols. If you didn't know, Wuhan attack come from the same place. It's actually local. Um, so yeah, we're gonna take care of that. This this morning um i'm also gonna try to finish up the ludwig order which is pretty much there i just gotta look at parts like parts like small hardware pieces you guys probably think like what takes you so long to get orders done it's a giant order so it's like the order for the whole year so picture some if someone told you like i don't know Pick all the groceries you're in order for a whole year. Would you be done in five minutes? No, takes a minute. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to get that done today. And then we have Sure coming in. Sure Microphones, um, Ryan, our sales guy. I think we've talked about him before, but he's coming in today to hang out. Really, really good dude. Really cool guy, good rep. So uh, we'll see what we can get on uh, the uh, vlog. And there, there we go. A lot of stuff happening today. Awesome. So hey, like I told you guys, uh, we have Ryan here from Sure. Um, he already talked to us, gave the whole crew the rundown on the new products, mm -hmm. uh, talked about how they work and all that good stuff. He's gonna show you real quick what he yeah. brought in. Awesome, thanks Rob. Uh, yeah, hey guys, I'm Ryan with McFadden Sales and with Sure. And uh, I was up here at Hubbard Music today, talking to the guys on a whole bunch of the new cool Sure goodies that are out. So what I was going over, um, Sure has a really cool single channel, uh, direct into your computer uh, XLR interface. So what any existing microphone you have, you plug it in XLR to this MVX2U, which I have in my hand, it's tiny. Uh, and then you have a USB-C out to go to your computer. You also have headphone output for monitoring, which is awesome. And this thing's fantastic if you just need a real inexpensive, easy way to get, you know, if you own a mic already, this is a great way to get into recording, demoing, doing Zoom meetings, what have you. Uh, and on the streaming and conferencing sort of thing, brand new uh, yesterday, Sure came out with the Sure MV7 Plus. This is an updated version on their MV7 microphone which was a, uh, a real interesting way to get that SM7B sound into a smaller footprint. And it's perfect for gamers, streamers, content creators, uh, anyone that's in that creative space. Um, besides that, Sure also has the Move Mic, which is a Bluetooth lavalier system that's available. Uh, you can use Sure's apps. There's an audio and a video app available. And it's a great way if you're doing interviews out in the, in the world, on the street, if you're doing interviews um, you know, in a studio environment, what have you, you can do direct connect to your phone via Bluetooth. There's also an option with a receiver for a DSLR uh, camera mount, which is awesome. Um, but this is the Move Mic. So check it out here at Hubbard. Um, I also have the SM7DB here, which you guys may have heard about. It's a SM7B microphone with a cloud lifter preamp built in which is killer. So you're saving some money, you're cutting down on clutter in your studio, and you're getting that awesome boosted sound uh, that we all know and love from all the podcasts and you know things that we watch on YouTube. Um, but yeah, come on down to Hubbard. They've got a bunch of sure stuff here. Let us know if you have any questions. Yeah, so Brian, you guys will see some of this stuff coming in. Mm -hmm. So be on the lookout. Thanks, man. Yeah, thanks guys. Get on that side. Are you rolling? Yeah. All right. Okay. Hey, so we have the superstar here today. The star of the show is here. Um, this is Josephine. And we thought we'd have her show you guys her new business card, which which I showed you the other day. You saw the card. You just didn't see the person. So, Joe, go grab your card. Okay. It's right. There's some right there. Yeah. Just grab yours. No, just yours. Okay. okay. 
So show the people your card. What's that title say? It says Justin McFarland, girl boss on it. Yeah, it does. So you're the girl boss. All right. Um, Rob, you want to show us your business card? We got Robbie here today, too. Sure. So there's him with his new business card. He's just the boss. So, yeah, there you go. So, hey, yeah, uh, they just got out of school, stopped in to see Dad, brought us some drinks, and thought we'd show business cards. So, Joe, you ready to boss the people my around? Card. Tell, boss, hey, boss Connor. Tell Connor. Don't get to work! Stop! Stay around and watch it! Now get to work! That's so a, let me tell you again. That's a lot, but there you go. She's scared. Joe, you have to be a nicer boss than that. She's Look, scared. Joe, 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 the people are watching. I know. You, well, you have, to be, uh, you have to be nice. All right. Well, hey, girl boss in training. <laughs> we'll catch up with you guys soon. <laughs> hey, so it's Thursday. We're at the Eastwood Mall store. Um, typically, I load in back there. But as you can see, there's a crane. So oh, there's a crane back there. So I'm staying out of the crane's way. So I'm doing the unusual uh, load in the main door, which I don't know if I've ever done in the whole year I've been here. So uh, here we go. Good thing it's a small load today. Got the truck parked up front. Uh, little load ready there. Like I said, thank God it's not too much. That'd be annoying. And uh, yeah, head to the main entrance, which is semi-complicated. But we'll make it work. What am I dropping? Mic stand. Mic stand shaft down. Got this one open box. It's going to be a problem all the way. See what happens. All right, back at it. Sorry for the Blair Witch Project news there. All right, let me get in these doors. I'll get you right back. So we're in with the mall walkers today. Yeah, I'm gonna pull this in the store here and uh, get the day going. There goes that mic stand shaft again. All right, so uh, we're inside. It's actually been a couple hours since I've lugged that cart in. Doggone mic stand was killing me but uh yeah so it's been a couple hours sold in ibanez guitar um had a couple other customers in and then uh, i had to make some phone calls like i wasn't planning on doing this but uh this install i quoted like last summer that i thought was dead has been uh brought back to life so now we're scrambling seeing what we could do to get this install back to moving uh customers asking questions and we gotta make some changes so i've been on the phone lots of on the phone so uh so we've done so far i'm probably gonna try to get that ludwig order done today i did get my order submitted to our good buddy mark over at cardinal percussion uh for the attack drum heads um some of the vader sticks the stick bundles we get from him uh, and uh i asked him if he could have it ready this morning by nine and he didn't want to go in early so i didn't get my order yet but uh maybe tomorrow so uh yeah we're waiting on that one and then uh Oh, we're doing some Wuhan symbols too. I oh, ordered some Koi. We haven't had them yet, so we'll let you know. Um, yeah, Koi symbols from Wuhan. They're hot. Uh, guys like them, so we're gonna try some out. Uh, and then Ludwig, I got some time uh, right now. Uh, pretty slow right this second, so I'm gonna jump into that Ludwig order that I got probably 90% done. I still need to look at those parts, so I need to see what hardware and parts we need to add. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Uh, I got a lady looking in the window, wondering why this guy's talking to himself. I do it for you. So um yeah we're jumping into the ludwig order hoping to get that wrapped up that fender order i placed last week should be coming any day so a bunch of guitars a couple amps and things so uh yeah good stuff happening catch up with you soon so for those of you that don't care about rock and roll that's fine no problem uh, maybe you're a jazz guy right oh i just love jazz i think jazz is great well let me tell you something john coltrane annoys me john coltrane's one of the most annoying people to me as far as playing goes. Oh, you're wrong, that's fine. I'm fine with that, I'm fine with being wrong. I'd rather wake up to Pharaoh Sanders ripping You Gotta Have Freedom every morning of my life than listen to 30 seconds of a John Coltrane solo. That's fine, hate on me, hate on this. This isn't gonna stop either. Humidifier hot takes are here to stay. The last one I almost overfilled though, I'm not gonna lie. So if you disagree, maybe, you know, throw something in the comments. I'm not going to retort to any of it. I'm just going to probably laugh at whatever you have to say or laugh at the fact that we're arguing about it. But we're not going to argue with you about it. You guys can just argue about it in the comments. It'll be like my late night entertainment. And please don't let me down in that, in that regards. All right, we'll see you later. 
Howdy ho travelers and good morrow and whatnot. It's uh it's almost the end of Thursday. Um I'm gonna be wrapping up here soon. It's been a very slow day, I'll say I'll I'll admit that. Still getting over from I guess cold round two. I've been coughing like crazy, I've been having these crazy coughing fits and uh just hasn't been hasn't been that fun. But yeah, um I'm gonna be wrapping up here in a minute. Um fill humidifiers and make sure everything's good to go i thought i heard the phone ringing i guess i should have brought it with me um yeah so um not much to it today pretty slow so i'm gonna be getting out of here soon um wish i had more for you but wasn't much to it today so i'll see you guys tomorrow good morning hey it's friday april 12th and you know what the importance of that day is my birthday so uh yeah, it's my birthday. The big uh, four or five, so uh, 45. So it's Friday, it's my birthday. What am I doing for my birthday? I'm gonna finish the Ludwig order and uh, it's, ready, it's ready to go. I just gotta call our sales rep today. Got a couple questions for him. I'm gonna clarify a couple things. Um, and then the Ludwig order is going in. Then, not maybe then, but I got a guy coming in, a good buddy of mine uh, named Mike. Uh, we sold him a PA system. I'm gonna help him tweak it just a bit. So he's gonna come in here uh, first thing uh, before the storm. He's coming at 9.30, we don't open until 12. So um, he's getting the gold star treatment. So uh, yeah, it's my birthday, submitting the Ludwig order. We got the order from Mark, we're gonna split that up. So get that uh, put out here and sent out to the mall and uh, help Mike out with his PA system. So it's Friday, it's my birthday, let's do this. Howdy ladies and gents. We just opened up the mall. Yeah, let's take a look real quick. And I feel like a hobbit. I got my uh, my guitar with me. We're traveling to Morador. We're going to uh, have a good day today, guys. Let's see. Let's open up this here said tripod. Yeah, pretty much just show you guys how I open up the mall here. What you do, click on this little power amp here. So we got some music and tunes. Then I find this little mousey here start to click and make uh, funny noises. Pretty much it, we just turn on the power. I gotta open up the gate, probably make a new sign today. Um, pretty much it guys, I'll check in with you guys later. Hey, so uh, I just finished with the customer bringing the PA in. I forgot to film it. It came a couple minutes earlier than I thought. So uh, yeah, we set it up, we set it up in the store. The store's not open yet. So set it up, gave him a few pointers, straightened a couple things out. Yeah, that's service here, small business service. Um, yeah, he came before we're open, opened up, I let him in, we planned this. And uh, yeah, just uh, talked him through it, walked him through it. He brought his guitar in, he sang some, he played some, we got it tuned in just like he wanted. And uh, yeah, that's what we did. So good way to start my day, good way to spend my birthday. Um, TJ texts me, apparently he's bringing me Duncan. I could get into that. So uh, yeah, we get TJ here and diving into the Ludwig order. Almost done. Good morning, it's Friday. Um, I just got to the store. It's also Rob's birthday. So um, I stopped at um, the grocery store and bought some uh, just mini cupcakes. They didn't have exactly what I was looking for, so this will have to do. But um, yeah, so let's go in and, uh, and see the birthday boy. Oh, it's not even in here. Hello? Hello? Oh! There you are! Huh? Hey! I was looking for you. I'm working on my birthday. Uh, apparently. What are you doing? Back door open and then yeah. I see, so I thought it was Mario. No, it was me. Are you mature for your age? Huh? Are you mature for your yeah, age? Yeah, I wore this shirt just for my birthday. <laughs> do you like it? I do. I thought it'd be a good birthday shirt. Happy birthday. Hey! They didn't have exactly what I wanted to get, but I, I wanted to, I wanted to see if they had like a small like cookie cake or something. But, I can get into a uh, cupcake. But so happy birthday i brought you a, uh, i brought you a treat too for my <laughs> <Okay>. birthday <laughs> for your birthday yes all right so we're gonna party it up be all sugared up yep 
Um, sometimes you never know what's going to show up and, uh, got another order of fender. This was very unexpected. Yeah. So, uh, our FedEx guy came in and said we had like 30 packages to come in. So we got it. Here we are. So bunch more fender, uh, reload just dropped. We've got amps and there's plenty of guitars here. So I don't know. I don't know what's in here, but we've already seen a cool, a few cool things. Yeah. Just just hooked them in the door we typically help the fedex guy on an order like this um, so yeah we just carried them all in our fedex guy is super cool so yeah. we help him out haven't even have done nothing yet except get them in the door so we'll be splitting them up you see them at both stores but yeah that's what we do we got them in now the fun i'm excited yeah so um check in each store see what we got